Hey, I'm Dusty, friends call me Moose. I'm the dude behind cameratips.com. And in this video, I wanna show you how to set up lock-on autofocus on the Sony A6000. Now, lock-on autofocus is a great way to track moving subjects. And in order for it to work really well, what we wanna do is set our focus area to wide and the focus mode to AFC continuous. I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to set this up. On top of your camera, go ahead and locate the C1 custom function button. And if you press that by default, it's gonna bring up the focus mode menu. And here we're gonna select AFC. Next on the back of the camera, go ahead and press the function button, highlight the focus area tab, enter that menu and select wide. Now we're gonna uh, go ahead and enable lock on autofocus. So press the menu button, go to the very first tab over to page five and then down to lock on autofocus and enter that menu. Here we're gonna select on. Now you'll see some instructions on your LCD screen where it's uh, kind of giving you a target to aim at. And if I press the button inside the control wheel, that will tell the camera what to uh, focus on. So if I go ahead and aim it here, you'll see some white boxes appear around my intended subject. If I half press and hold the shutter button, you'll see that those boxes turn green. And that tells me that that subject is being continuously tracked and in focus. Now, if you wanna change what is in focus or what's being um, locked on by the autofocus system, you can do that again by pressing the button inside the control wheel one more time. And you'll see that on-screen menu again, aim it at your other subject, press it, and now you've got those boxes around the other subject. So if I half press the shutter, you'll see that it continuously focuses on that new subject. Now, if you're still trying to figure out how this camera works, maybe you're unsure of which settings to use, I actually just released a set of really simple cheat sheets for the Sony A6000 that show you the exact settings I use for things like portraits, sports, landscapes, and more. You can kind of think of them like recipes. I show you which shooting mode, which exposure settings like aperture, shutter speed, and ISO. I also go over the autofocus settings I use for different subjects and scenes. So if you want to check that out, I'll put a link down in the description below. Uh, until next time, thanks for watching. Catch you later. Thank you.